Yo, yo, yo. What up, guys? Um, so crazy, uh, this weather right now, and I'm like stumbling on my words, but um, I went to a gratitude meeting earlier today uh, where I used to work, and the place that saved my life. And, you know, it is absolutely incredible what you will hear when you are open to it. I wanted to take this time to also talk about keeping your faith, right? Keeping your faith in the storm, so to say. So, not everyone is going to believe in your dream. Even your family is going to question you. Your family is going to let you down. But your faith in what you believe in cannot waver. You have to be able to, you know, stand in the storm, so to say. And it's absolutely perfect I'm talking about this because a storm's coming towards the beach right now. And as I'm watching these waves, you know, it's, it's kind of like life for me. Um, you never know what the day's gonna bring. You never know what emotions the day is gonna bring. You know, for me, I had, I, I had an incredible day. You know, I, there was some ups and downs as far as emotions are concerned. Um, but your faith has to remain the same, especially when you're trying to achieve a goal. If you feel something in your heart, something that was put into your heart, you can't ever give up on it. If it's what you believe in your soul, then it was put there for a reason. It's kind of like, you know, you're playing cards, you know what I mean? And you have an ace. And the other people don't know you have an ace. And that's what a dream is for me. You know, that's what my dream with this company is. That's what my dream for life is. So for anyone listening to this, for anyone watch, watching this, if you have a dream, stick to your dream. Never give up on what is happening in your life. There's gonna be ups and downs, but you know something is pure and the intentions are pure if you stick to that dream no matter what. Never waver in your faith. You have to keep your faith strong when things are going well and when things are going you know, bad, so to say. But bad is all perspective. Um, like I was talking about earlier today, I, I went to the gym and did squats and I did a, this brutal leg workout, you know? And uh, this is my first time squatting again in like maybe five months just because of this injury. And before that I was squatting crazy heavy, right? And today I wasn't able to squat very much and of course immediately I wanted to get upset with myself or I wanted to uh, pick apart what I was doing. And then, you know, later from the gym, I had some things happen with people questioning, you know, what I'm doing, right? And um, you can't expect anyone to see your vision and you can't expect anyone to be able to agree with what you're doing. If you believe in something, it's your belief. Always stay true to that, never waver. You have to be an outlier. You have to dream big. My biggest fear would be to die and not achieve the things I'm trying to achieve or to live a common life where I'm just working some job just because I think that's what I'm supposed to do. For me, that's prison and that might as well be death. All my life, I have always tried to achieve greatness. Whether that was, you know, wanting to be an incredible football player, you know, then wanting to be a, a really big model and uh, an actor as well, right? So aim for the stars. Some people are never gonna aim for the stars. They're mentally weak. You have to be mentally tough, always pushing forward, deal with the pains, deal with the ups and downs, move forward, don't allow any negativity in your life. Don't allow people in your life who don't have the same vision as you. 
keep moving forward. You have everything you need. You're a beautiful person. You are exactly as the world created you to be. Weather the storm. Life's gonna be up and down like those waves. But just like those surfers out there, you gotta ride that shit. And guess what? Sometimes you're gonna fall, but guess what? You can always get back up. That's all I got right now. No matter what, I'm not gonna quit. I'm a fighter. I've always been a fighter. That dog's for sure a fighter. I got him out the pound and they told me I didn't want him and they told me not to take him. He bites and doesn't listen to anyone. You know what I said? I said, perfect, give him to me. I'll check in with you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, let me know what I can do for you. Leave some comments, any questions I can help you with. Thank you again, have a blessed day. You have everything you need inside of you. Be proud of you.